You know, you really think if you're buying something like a hat or a t-shirt and you're buying it from the United States military that the product would be made in the USA, you wouldn't have to check for this sort yeah, you of know, thing? I don't think people, I never thought about this. So yeah. I just started thinking about it when we heard from the, about this guy. But you know, there's actually a law that prohibits military clothes from being made in foreign countries. Those are items given out from the military to service people. But non-service military items, not the same laws, and that's this ah, guy's that's beef. Key. Yeah. I paid $29.95 for it. Money well spent for 30-year Army veteran Peter Hollister. He buys military swag from the Army Air Force Exchange website. It's a store where military families can buy low-priced goods. I found a section on the website saying retired military gear and uh, went to that and sure enough this cap was in that. One problem. It was made in China. Yep. U.S. Army cap purchased on a U.S. Army website made nowhere near the U.S. That's really what bothered me the most was I wasn't buying it at some knockoff you know, place. Not to mention he thought the armed forces had a rule against using clothing made in other countries, which it does, but there are a lot of stipulations and military's by American law only applies to soldier uniforms, not exchange items. A spokesman says the exchange supports U.S. made products. However, in order to maintain our assortments, sometimes we must partner with overseas vendors. China still enjoys a favored nation status in U.S. trade agreements. Whatever the reason, this retired army officer thinks it's just wrong. It's like buying an American flag. Flag made in China. Oh, I remember when this went on with the Olympics as well. Okay, yeah. so so beyond the military, are, aren't things usually marked though, made in America, and or they have an American flag I guess, at the very least? Well, the rules is basically cars, textiles, wool, and fur are the only products that have to be labeled if they're made in America. The other products might say it, but you just really don't know. So you really have to look to yeah. see. And sometimes they, they're assembled in America, but made, you oh, know, the products details. from another country. Yeah, so all that. <laughs> anyway, go to abc15.com sections and let you know to find out. How to uh, how to do anything related to consumer? And let me know if you uh, need my help. Here's how to get hold of me.